Hello, Capricorn. Okay, so what is your ex thinking? Remember, just like how it's it sounds, it's what it is. You know, what is your ex thinking? So, Capricorn, this is not so much about you. It's about your ex. And yes, for some of you guys, it's like, why do we care? Why why do we need to know what what do they have to do with us but believe it or not there are some people that are still trying to get back with their ex or and this could be any type of ex could be you know just you're, you're separated you're divorced but i mean things are just out of whack and you're just like um this is not really what i wanted but it kind of happened every situation is different so we have to you know keep our um minds very open Okay, so for those who do want to know, well, then, all right. If you want to book a private reading with me, my information is in the description. I will also have it in the comments below. Okay, so let's go ahead and begin. All right, some cards already flipped over. Uh, okay. So it seems like at first they were kind of like, did this really happen? Um, could be an air sign that you were with and uh, I was gonna say Aries. Maybe for some of you it is an Aries Cancer no No <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry you guys um, air Again, I keep wanting to say Aries a Gemini Aquarius or a Libra Okay, so they were definitely you know not sleeping at night and nights and they we're just going through a lot mentally thinking, you know, how, how did all of this happen? You know, what, a lot having to do with the mind. Okay. Let's just think of it, think of it like that. You know, some of them, they couldn't even sleep at night, a restless night. And, you know, it, it's, it was just too much. Okay. All right. But it could also be what I'm getting as well is that they were working a lot. Some of them had multiple jobs and maybe even children. So much going on in their life that even being in a relationship was too much. Like it was everything, everything, it was just too much, okay? For those who were just, you know, together for a little bit. <clears throat> and uh, for some of you, it was just kind of like, um, I'm, I'm sorry for the ex. It... <sighs> You know, it's still, it was taking a toll on them. They were thinking about it, you know, for some time. Okay, moving on. The Five of Cups. So this is having to do with emotions now. So I feel like they've already went through the worst. You know, f mentally and emotionally. So I feel like they've gotten to the point where they accepted what has happened. And they're ready to move forward. Okay. So, could also be a... Um, a, wa a water sign, Cancer, Scorpio, or a Pisces. All right, let's pull some more cards out. I'm sorry you guys are a little cricket because my camera is like having some issues here. Okay, so yeah. For some of you guys have been together for some time and, you know, it's been a lot. For some of you guys, you've been together for many years, um, on and off, the same, all same, all, over and over and over and over again. It's like, you know, you've taken the same hit every single time. Okay, so I feel like they, they're standing up for themselves now. They're standing up for, you know, how they feel and so on and so forth. So it's... I mean, the way it looks in the beginning, yeah, they were they were going through a lot. But it's like, it is what it is. Let's move on. Now let's pull out two more because I feel like I need two more. Let's, let's kind of see how if they're thinking about getting back or not. Okay, four of wands. Let's get one more out before... I wrap this reading up to kind of see. Okay. The four of wands. So, you know, yeah, a lot of you are thinking, yeah, maybe this person will get back with me. 
Well, I mean, I'm not saying it can't happen for some of you. And for some of you, it's like the terms are going to change. So if this person does contact you and, you know, want to try to get back with you, I feel like now they're going to be more grounded. They're going to um, say, you know, like, okay, if, you know, we make this work. There's going to be some sort of condition, some... Um, it's not just going to be like, let's get back together. I miss you. I love you. Blah, blah, blah. No, there, it's going to be a little more, um, complex. Okay. Um, and for some of you, I keep saying some of you, I, I don't want to confuse you guys. Remember, this is for your ex. So for them, it's also like, okay, you know, I've, I've gone through some stuff. Now I'm ready to get back out there. Um, I'll be good. You know, I deserve better and I will find better and I'll be good. So yeah, for some of them, you know, they're already looking forward to meeting somebody new, marriage and just settle down. Okay, so I mean, it's possible. It's possible. The Knight of Swords. Again, their energy, their thoughts, everything is, is positive. It's where they need to be at. Okay, now this card here is the overall energy. And really, it's not It's not so much of a, a big thing here. You know, it has to do with um, keeping negative people out and just working hard and moving forward, so on and so forth. Okay, and of course, I know some of you guys saw that tower card and really nothing bad. It's just saying that you've cut ties and look at there's your card. Capricorn's card. Um, the bad has already left and now it's all about moving forward, being positive. You know, finding somebody new again could be a fire sign, Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius. Could be another air sign, Gemini, Aquarius, or Libra. If those... This person, this person can also be getting back with you, okay? For some of you, for some of you that have been through a lot, you know, mentally abuse, everything, most likely not. But I'm not saying it won't work out. Okay, so let me just pull out one card from the Romance Angels. And then... We can go ahead and wrap this up. Okay. Let go of control issues. Okay. Let go of control issues. That's a really big one here. And you will. You will. In this month of January, things will definitely get back to where they need to be at. Um, again, things happen for a reason. It is what it is. And you learn from them. And you have to, you know, it just makes you stronger as a person all right, so very good. Let go control issues. I mean, we, we could see that. I mean, the tower card here, the four of swords. I feel like you guys are, are going to get past that. Okay. All right, you guys, thank you so much. And I will talk to you very soon. Take care.